Wow, Davey, what a fashion statement. Totally. And look at you. You are my kind of woman. I like the way you dress. Well, we are complete trendsetters. Not. not. I just want to donate clothes to City Church Red, and this was the easiest way to carry them all out. Me too. We think so much alike. And now, the news. City Church is honored to be connected to the Kyler Brownsville neighborhood through City Church Red. With opportunities to serve nearly every Saturday, you can be a part of making a lasting difference. There are a couple of amazing things coming up. First of all, Red's Clothes Closet will be open on Saturday, October 13th for providing gently used clothes to our friends in Kyler Brownsville. In preparation for cool weather. Which is not here yet. But it will be soon. Anyway, in preparation, you can bring long sleeves, shirts, pants, shoes, blankets, and coats. Pretty much everything but underwear. <laughs> Just be sure it's gently used. Bring your donations here to 1624 and we will prepare to give those away on October 13th. City Church's own coffee shop, Blue Door, is your place for hot or cold drinks. They also offer a variety of delicious foods with punny names. Oh, and you gotta check out the new Arnold Room. It's the right fit for small group meetings and quiet study. Oh, I get it. The Arnold Room, located in Blue Door, next to Arnold Hall, the SCAD building. Yep. Blue Door Coffee and Waffles, located at 1718 Bull Street. Open 7.30 to 5.30, Monday through Thursday, and 9 to 2, Friday and Saturday. I tried it, and, you know, I'll be back. If you were here last year, you will recall a life-changing event we call Treat Street. It happened right here in our parking lot, and it's going to happen again. On October 31st, Treat Street will have games, bounce houses, food, candy, a dunking booth, and more. Here's how you can be involved. First, bring bags of individually wrapped candy here to donate. We are currently already taking donations. Secondly, you can lead a game, decorate a trunk of your vehicle for trunk or treat. And third, you can volunteer for setup and or tear down that night. Email d at citychurch.life and let them know that you are interested. We expect a huge turnout this year. Last year, we had hundreds of neighborhood people show up. We are currently in the middle of a corporate reading and prayer focus on the Book of Acts. We hope you are finding that it is a user-friendly plan and that you are joining in with us. The point is that the Book of Acts can be read in a day, but the events in the Book of Acts took place over a period of around 30 years. Be encouraged that God works in powerful ways and the same is available for your life. And also be encouraged that sometimes there is a waiting and a resting period. Whatever place you're currently in, we are glad that you're a part of City Church. And if you need a copy of the reading plan, grab one from Guest Services on your way out today. And follow along the timeline at citychurch.life or at facebook.com slash citychurchsavannah. We see an example of giving in the early church like in Acts chapter 2. As lives were being impacted by the power of God, it says that they were selling their possessions and belongings and distributing the proceeds to all as any had needed. Lives were being changed, needs were being met, and the believers were giving generously. We want to thank you for being generous here at City Church. So many of you have generously given your time, talents, and resources to meet needs here in our community. And when you give to City Church, we aim to put it right back here in this neighborhood, our community, our city, and specific places around the globe. We do this through opportunities here at 1624, as well as Red for local outreach, and City Church has also invested in places like Mexico, Africa, and Southeast Asia. And there are three ways to give. Online, text to give, or drop it in the giving box by the front door. If you're a visitor with us today, we don't ask you to give, but rather you should have received one of these. Fill it out and return it to guest services so we can give you a special gift. We are so happy that you're here with us today, and thank you for spending your Sunday mornings here with us. Well, those treat treat booze aren't going to build themselves. Shall we, Dee? <laughs> Indeed we shall. And now over to you, Pastor Dim.